no matter how many years you sit doing zazen, you will never become anything special. We stop the one who can't cease from seeking things outside and practice with our bodies with a posture that seeks absolutely nothing. This is Zazen. Gain is delusion. Loss is enlightenment. You don't seek the way. The way seeks you. Heaven and earth give themselves. Air, water, plants, animals and humans give themselves to each other. It is in this giving themselves to each other that we actually live. Whether you appreciate it or not, it is true. Satori has no beginning. Practice has no end. My sermons are criticised by certain audiences. They say that my sermons are hollow, not holy. I agree with them because I myself am not holy. The Buddha's teaching guides people to the place where there is nothing special. People often misunderstand faith as a kind of ecstasy of intoxication. True faith is sobering up from such intoxication. Stop trying to be something special and just be what you are. Hold fire. Just sit.
It all begins when we say, I. Everything that follows is illusion. Everyone imagines that their ego is something unchangeable. Some immovable center point, which everything revolves around. Buddhism means no self, nothing to gain. You must be one with the universe and all living beings. When you practice Zen, it has to be here and now. It has to be about yourself. Don't let Zen become a rumor that has nothing to do with you. Zazen is the Buddha that we form out of our raw flesh. Zazen means putting into practice that which cannot be thought. Zazen is the Dharma switch that turns on the whole universe. When somebody asks me what Zazen is good for, I say that Zazen isn't good for anything at all. And then some say that in that case, they'd rather stop doing Zazen. But what's running around satisfying your desires good for? What is gambling good for and dancing? What is it good for to get worked up over winning or losing in baseball? It's all good for absolutely nothing. That's why nothing is as sensible as sitting silently in Zazen. In the world, good for nothing just means that you can't make money out of it. Often people ask me how many years they have to practice Zazen before it shows results. Zazen has no results. You won't get anything at all 
out of Zazen. In true Dharma, there's nothing to gain. In false Dharma, there's something to gain. The way of Buddha means that there is nothing to seek, nothing to find. If there's something to find, no matter how much we practice, it's got nothing to do with the Buddha Dharma. If there's nothing to find, that's the Buddha Dharma. You say you're seeking the way, but what does it mean if you're seeking the way just to satisfy yourself? You want to become a Buddha? There's no need to become a Buddha. Now is simply now. You are simply you. And tell me, since you want to leave the place where you are, where is it exactly you want to go? Zazen means just sitting, without even thinking of becoming Buddha. We don't achieve enlightenment, Satori, through practice. Practice is Satori. Each and every step is the goal. You think that you're something special because you've got Satori. but you're simply showing off your sack of flesh. When an ordinary person has got Satori, they're called a Zen devil. This is because they think they're something special. When people talk about Satori, it usually just means that a devil has acquired magical powers. When you know you're doing something bad, then it isn't so serious. But people who chat about their Satori 
don't even realize they're doing something bad. That's why they're such helpless cases. No illusion is as hard to cure as Satori. Don't take pride in your practice. It's clear that any Satori you take pride in is a lie. You've got it backwards if you talk about stages of practice. Practice is Satori. You can't hold on to yourself. The very moment you give yourself up, you realize the self which is one with the universe. Precisely that self, which I haven't thought up, is who I really am.